was at high school. Yeah, went straight to work. And it was pretty much just hanging out on the weekends, clubbing, you know, I'll be, yeah. I'll be working, I'll be going out Thursday, Friday, Saturday, mm. Sunday, drinking, mm. you know, not even up. Uh, and no one telling you to stop, eh? Nah, I think because back then, the, the it's not, I'm not saying that I hung out with bad friends. Yeah. It was more like, we all just like to have fun. Anyway. Yeah, that's right. Everyone was, everyone was just in it for the short term, not the long term yet, you know what I mean? Because <laughs> we haven't grown up yet. So, but that's how, that's how the mindset is yeah, back then. You know? And I, I do have a few friends that were, I actually have one friend um, who actually was part of the group and he's the only person till this day who hasn't succumbed to anything like like, like drugs, drugs or, or whatever or like. yeah and he's still like, he's one of good, my, my good friends and he's wow. like and he still till this day hasn't touched anything, touched anything good on him, that, like like out of his own will you know i mean besides yeah. getting spiked or whatever oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he's still enjoying yeah, that yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um in terms spiked of actually himself? yeah i mean like Imagine you're hanging around with six, seven people, you know, who's yeah. always like to do all the, you know, to the party drugs and all that. And then mm. you're still the sole standing person that's, you know, still doesn't do that. And I always have mad respect for Yeah, 100%. For like that, yeah. You know? So yeah. that, that's awesome. But going back to um, my journey, yeah, yeah, I did all that. I, I how did you get introduced to that? But how did you, like, you know what I mean? Coming from our schools, uh, we went to Marshall Actually, then you're right. You're right. You know what? Um, to say the least, how it all started was getting so socialized. I met I met a group of friends. I actually met a group of friends from around with girls. Ah. So how it all started was obviously you go to Marceline, you're only gonna meet Marceline people, right? <laughs> I didn't have any friends there. And then my cousin was dating someone. Um, you know Take? I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, Oh, I named him, but anyways. <laughs> Shout out to you. <laughs> Shout out to you, <laughs> Anyways, my cousin, my, my cousin he was know. dating someone from around with girls. And then it would start off like that. So he, he dated someone. And then he invited us on the weekend. We all met, and that's how the social. Oh, beginning. okay. There right, you so go. Then yeah. I met. There you go. And bro, I tell you the funniest story. Okay, till this day, and this is truth. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, one of the um, I, I, I grew up. I grew up with my, my cousin and I. My cousin and I. We went to the same pub. Um, um, public school Paddington Public oh yeah and then we grew up with another another guy and I'm not gonna name names alright but he's he grew up with us and he used to always give me shit like he used to always like ah oh, rain this rain to this rain to this and that, that, uh, you know? I was growing up I was always a short and so I'm the skinniest like to one bully the bully or one. just like jokingly it's, we were we were all hanging out us three but I would always be like the short end of the stick oh, I'm okay, always yeah, like yeah. ah the, that guy, the guy. Yeah, 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 the, yeah he's yeah. the cool guy he yeah, can yeah. sing he can, yeah, yeah. this is all growing up I was the shortest I was the smallest whatever it would yeah, be yeah. you know so now growing up I used to get a little shit like that so now he went to Rami Boys and then my cousin was dating a girl from Ruby Girls. So then when these people started knowing that Marceline guys, you know how we had a little rivalry yeah, between yeah, Marceline yeah. and Ruby Boys? Yeah. yeah. Now, I, I, uh, my cousin was, yeah, dating with that girl from Ruby Girls. So we all started hanging with the Ruby Girls. And then they suddenly knew our oh, Ruby Boys started knowing that, oh, yeah, we're hanging out with Ruby Girls. Who's this Marceline private school guys? You know, uh, I, mean? yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to get shit for. And then there was all these. There was all this animosity growing up, like just a little high school. Yeah, 100%, you know? yeah. Look, till these days, these these days now, it's all the same guys from that school. They're war friends now. So we're all, <laughs> so this one's funny. So, yeah. so this is all a story of us growing up. It's not like I'm talking shit about them. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. no, we all growing up. Hundred percent. I respect yeah. all the boys now. We're all friends. What were we defending back then, bro? At school. <laughs> I don't hey, even like, know. What is it, hey? This is like, I don't like even Like Marcel and Randy, like what was it? Yeah, they like Randy boys represent. Yeah, yeah, Because yeah. like, Randwick was seen as like a more rougher school. Yeah, Randwick boys was public. Yeah, and then because we, we had are, Catholic school. Yeah, we're Catholic school. We and, wore ties. And little ties and stuff like that. We had a brother at a principal. And, and the girls so. liked us more because we look better, right? <laughs> yeah, but stuff like that, yeah, right? Yeah. And yeah. Um, so like, uh, there was always a rivalry, I know. But, but yeah. the thing is, everyone... There was friends from both schools. That 100%, were friends, like, 100%. Of friends. So there's always like one-off person. Yeah. I mean, growing up, it was always the case in everything. But yeah. in this topic, I was, I was, there was a little, a, a little bit of an animosity from them to us and I was getting hated on. And then <laughs> there was an incident um, where a certain person in my group, um, the um how do you call it he tagged someone's house's garage no way <laughs> from the randy boys group? yeah oh no that's what that's and, what all, bro. and then it all happened look i don't i don't really remember exactly what happened to detail but that kind of set it off and there was a massive so that incident set off the rest of your life the saying? rest of my high school like life. the way you're driven exactly yo 100 the way you thought and stuff like that big, 100 percent. if you want to sit back grab the mic yeah 100 percent. because what happened was um after that 
I, I turned to one of my friends and I was like, ah, oh, who, who know, can back me up? Because I don't know anybody. And this is the time when I'm still skinny rang. I'm, I'm a total nobody. I had no friends outside of school or nothing. So in terms of, um, in terms of um, who I knew to turn to, I don't know. So I, I, I asked my, my cousin, my cousin, um, we had a, a, a friend, um, um, a restaurant owner, <laughs> As, let's let's nickname him that yeah, yeah, restaurant, restaurant owner, owner. Okay. a friend of ours who you the know man, restaurant yeah. owner he sick knew food. some yeah he yeah sick food yeah. he knew he knew someone in the city and he knew a few people in the in the, in the asian oh, asian oh, crew in, in the, the asian yeah, yeah, yeah. hang out in the city no you know what i mean way. back then george street george street asian